Hey guys, during the tours at Peace Love and Vans, one of the most asked questions was how we made our dinette area. So I'm gonna teach you how I made this dinette area and you can do the same thing in your own van. So obviously, of course, you have to have a driver's seat uh, on a swivel and everything is based off the driver's seat. So the height of the table is based off the driver's seat and the height of this bench is based off the driver's seat. Now, if you have a ProMaster, you may want to consider lowering this seat right here. I lowered this seat three inches. I've got a swivel on it, which raises it an inch, and then I lowered it three inches. I cut these bases down three inches. I built this platform at the same level where this comes out here, and this platform is six inches tall all the way to the top. So coming out here, six inches, goes all the way down. Then when you build your bench here, the bench needs to be about as tall as your driver's seat. So when you someone sit in here and someone sit in here, they're at the same height. I see a lot of vans where the driver's seat is way higher or way lower. It's important to get this at the same level. Another thing that's important is that you have the right dimensions here. Okay, this is 18 inches from the seat to where your feet go. See here, we have 18 inches from the seat to the, to the bottom. And then your table, this table is right around 26 to 27 inches tall. This bench comes out to 24 inches. And the table I've got coming out just a little bit more because I wanted to get the most space I can from my table. So I've got my table coming out to 27 and a half. I made this table uh, 25 inches this way. Now, depending on how much room you have in your van, you may need to cut this down. Maybe you can only make your table 16 inches, maybe 20, but I would go for as big as you possibly can. It's important that this guy and this guy have enough room to sit down. So right here between this wall and the edge of this table, I have 20 inches. So with 20 inches, I can comfortably sit down. I wouldn't want this any closer. This side is much more forgiving because this, this chair will move back and forth. This table is made out of a piece of half inch birch plywood that I got from Home Depot. It's just regular birch plywood. So it's, it's very, very light. And then I bought a piece of maple and this maple is three quarters of an inch. So the maple actually hangs down lower than the thickness of the table. So what I did was I glued this maple trim around and I shot it with a brad nailer and then when it was all done this isn't going to be perfect and then you just sand this just a little bit to make this perfect all the way around if you want to get fancy with it you can add an extra bracket for your table and I'll show you in the description field where to get these brackets and where to get this uh, table mount this table will actually come down and mount in this bracket here and then it will be at the same level as the chair and the bench and then you can put an air mattress across here and then a smaller person uh, can, can sleep here so you can sleep three people in your van. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you guys are able to build a dinette like this. I don't see a lot of vans with this and it's really important to connect with your person at the end of every day, play some rummy, have a beer, do whatever. Um, but we love this table and this is where we spend most of our time. Over and out.